Which American muscle car is quickest in a drag race? Is it a Camaro ZL1? Or is it a Challenger Hellcat Red Eye? Or a Mustang 5 litre that's been supercharged? Well, we're gonna find out as we put GM against Dodge against Ford over the standing quarter mile. Let's see what happens. But before we do, I'm gonna talk you through these cars. So I am sat in the Camaro ZL1. So this has a 6.2 litre supercharged V8 and it normally puts out 650 horsepower. However, this one's been tuned and it now puts out 770 horsepower and 1,000 Newton meters of torque. And all that grunt is sent to the rear wheels by a 10 speed automatic gearbox. This car weighs in at 1,000 750 kilograms and it's worth about 70,000 pounds. Moving on to the Dodge. So that also has a 6.2 litre supercharged V8. However, that car is completely standard. And standard, it puts out 800 horsepower and 960 newton meters of torque. It drives the rear wheels via an eight speed automatic gearbox. The car is slightly heavier than this Camaro though. It weighs in at two tons. It's also more expensive the value of that here in the UK, 130,000 pounds. Finally, we come to the Ford. So it has a five litre supercharged V8. Normally that car is naturally aspirated, but American importer Clive Sutton from London actually imported a normal five litre GT, stuck a supercharger on it. And as a result, that car has 850 horsepower and 900 Newton meters of torque. It drives the rear wheels via a six speed manual gear box. I'm glad I'm not driving that. Could be a bit sketchy. The Mustang weighs in at 1,720 kilos and you can buy it now from Clive Sutton for £115,000. There's a link to Clive Sutton in the description. In fact, I want to say a huge thanks to all the people that have lent us their cars today and you can follow them by checking out their handles and so on and so forth once again in the description. Anyway, let's get on with this race. Buy, sell, car. Wow. Now, before we race, I'm going to first say hello to the driver of the Challenger. Hi, Yanni. How are you? So whatever. Oh, I've got to go. I've got to go. Speak to me. I'm filming the car. All right, bye. Bye. He's on his phone. Hi, Matt. Sorry, mate. <laughs> That's really bad, mate. I was on the phone really talking away. Well, I'm nattering to camera, doing all the stats. You're there just, what, socialising or maybe doing business? It was business and I was having issues that my staff didn't put a car in trickle charge and the batteries died now and I've got a customer complaining at me, but it's, yeah, it's just brutal. You do realise that is now in the video, yeah? Yeah, it's fine. It just wasn't on trickle charge. It wouldn't crash the car. It wasn't that extreme. Anyway, other than that and the trickle charge situation, how are you? I'm good, mate. I'm, I'm really good. I'm glad to be back. It's been a while. The weather's nice and I'm in a bad boy. This is nice. It's nice. It's powerful. It's rear wheel drive. Are, are you up for it? This could get pretty leery because last time when I raced you in an American muscle car, I was in the American muscle car and you were in the easy to launch Porsche 911 Turbo S, which you won. However, the tables are turned now. Well, not turned. We're both in high performance American muscle cars, which are traction limited. I'm hoping I can get off the line. It is very nice and dry. So hopefully it won't bog me down or hopefully it'll be like Fast and Furious where the front will lift up and you'll see me just bouncing down the road. Hopefully that will happen. I think it's more likely to just switch ends. Anyway, let's move on to the Mustang. And obviously, like I said, it's a manual car. So that's why we've got racing driver Sam driving that one. Samuel, how are you? Good morning, Matthew. How are we doing? Well, I'm all right. I've got an auto and we've put you in the tricky car. You know, you're called racing driver Sam. So you should be able to launch a manual, right? I mean, I'll give it a go. As long as I beat Yanni, I'm not too bothered. Anyway, before we race, let's do the first competition, which is the sound check. So I'm going to rev up this Camaro. And we can go all the way to six and a half. Oh, oh that's pleasing. Go on, Yanni, let's hear your Hellcat red eye. Oh, no way I've got a limiter. Are you taking the pee out of me? And it sounds so good apart from that limiter. What a shame. Let's move quickly on then to Sam. What have you got? Oh, I'm going to win this. Yeah, I just won it. That's the upgraded exhaust. Clive Sutton has fitted to that car. Yeah, you, you definitely did just win that. I'll, I'll accept that. Uh, yeah, no, you came last. I think the race might actually work out exactly the same, but let's find out, let's get on with it. But before we do actually race, 
If you haven't done so already, oh, mate. The way, sorry to interrupt you. Is that the Bumblebee car? Just so I know. It wasn't important. Yours is the Bumblebee car, isn't it? Or is mine? I don't know. No, this one is. Yeah, yours is. Transformers. Anyway, as I was saying. If you haven't done so already, please make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. We've got a load of other videos featuring kind of crazy American stuff. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on those. They're coming up soon. Anyway, let's race now. Let's see how these ones do. Traction holder! What a terrible gear change. Oh, he's all over the road. Oh, here comes the Dodge. Here we go. Here we go. The Dodge is coming. This is misfiring, engine management light, not happy. Yanni's probably going crazy, going, yeah, 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 I beat him on the line, oh, I caught him up, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see what he says. I bet he gets carried away. Oh, that was close on the line there, Jan. What, what do you think happened? She was twitching a little bit and then away we went. Sideways Sam over here. Oh, sorry, I mean racing driver Sam over here. And Matt, what happened, mate? Would you just slow up right before the end to let me win? Well, I didn't let you win, but the car sort of did. It just started misfiring and now I've got an engine management light. Sam, what's your excuse? <laughs> I was just having so much fun. I was going left, right, up, down. Eventually it went forwards and uh, yeah, by that time Yanni was just gone. It was good. I think I can do better. I tried to do it in the um, drag strip launch mode. Give me one more go. I'd like to try it using the handbrake. Yeah, we can have one more go, but I'm not sure that this is going to be participating. No one cares. No one clearly cares. I care. No one else seems to care. It's not very happy. Oh, it was winning, winning, winning. Saw the line and just choked. It's not giving full power. Do you want to have a little drive of it? No, I mean, I'll, I'll nurse it home. I mean, it's, there's, there's no point trying to, trying to push it if it's, not, if it's not happy. No, I don't think it is. A few moments later. Hi, Matt. Hello. Welcome, welcome to... Um... This car. Welcome to me. You broke, you broke your car, so you're joining me now. No, I didn't break it. It broke itself. Nothing broke to do itself. with me. So you weren't driving the car at the time it broke? I was driving the car. Okay, let's say you bought a new car, you're driving it, and it stops working. Do you go to your dealer and say, oh, look, I broke my car. Can I pay to have it fixed? Or do you go, oh, look, the car broke. You now need to fix it under warranty. <laughs> Matt broke the car. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'd done quite well as well to get away. I knew, I knew you'd be there going, oh my God, look at that. Oh, I've come back and just managed to beat the Camaro, but you didn't, it was misfiring like crazy. So anyway, I'm gonna jump in here with you, check out your skills or lack thereof, and um, add a bit of ballast. Not mate, that much ballast. I'll but... get you out of the car, mate, if you're gonna give me that attitude, mate. I'm the driver, you're in my car, so don't touch my stereo, <laughs> okay? And don't touch the electric seats, and don't touch the heated seats or do anything else. Can we listen to Hart? I don't mind a bit of heart, a bit of heart, a bit of 80s. It shows <laughs> yeah. how old we are. Yeah. Right, are we, are we racing? I've got a big one. You've got a big one? Heart. Oh, okay. I have got a <laughs> <laughs> You are a big one. Yeah. Don't kill me. Shush. Three. You look quite funny when you like back to start. Two. One. He's in a manual car and he's beating you off the line. I've done a great launch last time. It's your fault. How's it my fault? This was fine the last it's time. It's my fault that the car's broken. And it's my fault that you did a launch. How is it? Why is everything always my fault? Listen, if you base that compared to my first one, it was great. But then. <laughs> He has changed his settings. He did say change okay. his settings, didn't he? But, but before we get into that, how is it my fault? It's not my fault in any way. It's the extra <laughs> ballast. That should help. No, because I've got enough weight on my own. I don't need your little, your little twig body here. <laughs> how is it my fault? I was just sat here. Exactly, you put me off. Shall I go in with him? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to talk to him? Hello, Sam. 
Why is Yanni shaking his head? What's wrong with him? Well, he reckons that you only won because it was my fault. Right, right. Based on weight, or what are we? What are we talking about? Weight. Mm, I don't know. I thought your launch was awesome. I thought his was crap. It's actually quite funny how he sits in the car when he's launching it. He's like kind of like this, like um, a racing driver. Like, no, like a, some kind of like scared old person. You, honestly, normally you're like driving like Yeah, that. but because the brake and accelerator don't obviously work together at the moment, so I had to try and find the biting point. Uh, <laughs> the biting point? The biting it's not, it's point. not got a clutch. No, but it's the, you need the biting point because if you go too much on the brake, it spins up. If you go too far on the accelerator, it edges forward. You need to find that, that biting point. The balance. A biting point. Just to prove to Yanni that it's nothing to do with me being some kind of like weird jinx, can I come in with you, please? I would love that. Come on over. Oh, I'll take the camera with me. Alright then. <laughs> see you later. Alright, see ya. Been great having you. Yeah. Hello Sam, you alright? How are we doing? Yeah, I'm good thanks. How's the baby? He is... Awake. Awake. <laughs> that's, that's, that's a safe way to describe him. <laughs> He's going for his shots today, so I'm on tender hooks waiting for the phone call. Oh really? Yeah. Well you've got work to do here, so you know, you know your family comes second, right? <laughs> yeah, I always have. <laughs> and I, I would like to say that I did forget my anniversary today, Matthew, so I'm in big trouble. What? I know. To spend it with me? Yeah. Maybe it's our anniversary. Uh, <laughs> anyway, Yanni reckons I'm some kind of like car launch jinx. Get a cuddle like that. A little arm over the shoulder. Wow, cheating on me like that, Matt. He's really emotional today. Isn't he, he is, I don't know why. But anyway, all you have to do is beat him again, then it's proof that it's nothing to do with me. Okay. You've got some different settings, he said, and he wanted to know what they were. Not that it's going to make any me? difference. Yeah, that's what he said. What? He said, Sam's got some different settings, that's why he won. <laughs> you should see how he launches it. He sits I, like that. Like, I know, he, he sits like that. I've never really thought about it until I've been in the car with him just. <laughs> Show us how it's done. Three, two, one. Freaking old Sam. Oh, no attraction! Come on, Sam! Come on! Oh, he's pulling away. It was better though. Come on! Yeah, that Ooh. beautiful launch. Thank you. Honestly, in really good gear changes. And he had a good launch there. Yanni, <laughs> I, I don't think I'm a car launch jinx. That was better though. It was much better than when you were in the car. <laughs> yeah, but it's nothing, to, it's nothing to do with me. Was your launch as good as your last launch? Better, I'd say. Really? <laughs> See? Is that 2-1 to this? Yeah. No, because I won the first race, mate. Yeah, you did win the first race, or I don't know, you beat this in the first race, but now there's been two other races since, and this has won both of them. So best two out of three, you've lost. Yeah, that's 2-1 to you then, isn't it? There is two of you, though, and they're only one of me. Oh, you've got maths. I don't, I don't know maths. So then, what exactly happened? Well, the Ford won, completing the standing quarter mile in 12.5 seconds. The Dodge took 12.7 seconds, and although the Chevrolet had to be retired after the first race, when it did complete the standing quarter mile, it did it in 12.9 seconds. Hello. Hello, you all right? Maybe. <laughs> We're going to do a rolling race now. Yeah. Okay, good. I'm going to jump back in with you. Are you? Yeah. Oh, you have to. <laughs> Welcome back. Okay, yeah, I'm getting back in with you. I should put my camera back at the... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Need to cuddle. I felt bad I didn't get cuddle. <laughs> right, okay, so let's do this. Now we have a rolling race, Sam. We're going to do it just in normal drive. Comfort mode, have you got yourself in comfort or street or whatever setting it is? Street, just go street. So Sam, you do something similar. I don't know if you have those. Am I going to 500 brake or No, keep it at set full power, obviously. Okay. And then we're going to do a roll on 50 miles an hour. I'll call it in and it's first to the half mile. Because I've got a manual, remember? Doesn't matter. Um, you're going to be in in sixth gear and then you're gonna to have to drop it down like this car's got to kick down you're supposedly a racing driver you've got to drop it down from six to third okay right and rolling at what speed 50 but you're gonna get level with yanni oh, okay yeah this all sounds really fair no problem but you've already beaten him once right i think you're gonna do it again i've got faith in you sorry yeah just realize i'm sat next to you 
<laughs> right, let's do this anyway. This is enough chat. Right, go, come on. All right. Okay, get to 50. Yeah, six, Give me the okay, get level with you, honey. Right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, Yanni, yeah. look. Just look See ahead. I like to see what's going yeah, on. Yeah, but look, we're ahead of you. You should be looking ahead of you. Is that you. the code, is it? No, not yet. I don't know. No, we got Yeah, no, I'll back off. <laughs> yeah, you, you won. Uh, really? Yeah. <laughs> well, well, glad you're in to let me know that. Uh, <laughs> so, so the kick down on your gearbox sound was pretty slow. It was as fast as I'm happy to not money shift it. It's as fast as it was, if that makes sense. It's a very tight gate in this. I know Yanni likes that sentence, but um, yeah. So I, I don't think I could have gone much faster than that into third. Third to six is a big jump. I didn't know what revs I was going to go to. Look at him. Look at throwing his head back. Stop <laughs> talking. Maybe <laughs> second, but then I didn't want it to go up. Was that like just um, some kind of public announcement? Because you just went on for bloody <laughs> ages then. You know, you said you couldn't go any quicker. Could someone that's better than you have gone quicker? Matthew, in life, there is always someone better than you. But today is the day and we're here, so we can only deal the hands we've been given. OK, so you lost that then. Let's move on and um, <laughs> take your crap downshift out of it and we'll um, do it in manual mode, yeah? My downshift was perfect. I just had to actually do something physical. Yeah, and he just put his foot down. Technically speaking, that's still physical unless he managed to do it like by just like, some kind of like mm -hmm. the force. Uh, fine. So I'm really, really uh, baited today. Again, but I want to be in a gear. That's fair. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I don't know why I'm so, I'm just angry today. Are you? Yeah, a little bit angry. You seem okay. It's because my car broke. Oh, it yeah. broke. I didn't break it. Yeah. Yeah. Agreed. Matt, this has just thrown up an issue now as well. So I need to turn it off and restart it. So it seems that Sam's car has thrown up an issue now. Is that my fault? Was that my fault as well? No, that's his fault. <laughs> Not the car's fault. <laughs> so he's broke a car and you've broke a car. I'm the only one that's got a car. Last man standing, I win. We need to continue with this video, so should we get Sam in the car? And I'll race against myself. Yep, let's do it. Okay. Cool. Come on, Sam. Um, come join us. Oh, like a family adventure. We can off. Get him running. Oh, that's family. quite a good run. Yeah, Better well, than your run. Yeah, my run's awful because I'm really flat footed. Right, so I'm here. Can I come? Yeah, yeah. You're going to have to get in the back though because you're right. the shortest. All right. Thanks a million. Because you're the shortest. Am I though? I don't know. Stand up. Oh. You think you are? Imagine <laughs> you're outside the car. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let me put my feet up. I here didn't lose the tallness legs. race. Does this have belts? You don't need belts. Any you belt? only go so well, slow. Where we're going, you don't <laughs> need belts. <laughs> what to heaven? Don't need roads. Right, okay, so what we're going to do here, this is a um, rolling race from 50 miles an hour. This time we've got the car in the sportiest setting, manual, manual mode for the mode. gearbox. Go up to 50, then I'll call it in. You need to get level with yourself though, <laughs> all right? Can you make <laughs> sure you do that? Okay, ready, go. Come on, my 50. Get to 50. Come on, easy back off, then let yourself catch up. Oh, why is it changing gear? Oh, that's called an all You're, like, you're going to lose against yourself, <laughs> you bloody idiot. All right, go on. Right, are you ready? Ready. Okay, get level. Get level. Are you level? Ready. Three, two, one, go. Oh, come on, Sam. You're behind at the moment, Sam. Oh, that's a good gear change. Yeah, Sam, you're still right, behind. Right, <laughs> you're still behind. I can't see him. I'm going to get to the hot first. Him. Oh, that's it, that's it, stop. Oh, no. Oh. I was so far ahead. Okay, I think I won that. No, I think, no, Matt, I crossed, I think Matt did win I, that. I crossed, yeah, I crossed yeah, the half right. mile first. No. <laughs> right. Um, Sam, now we've done that bit of nonsense, shall we go back to your car and see if it's kind of fixed itself? Yeah, hopefully. Sam, have you fixed your car by being in this car? I can confirm I have fixed this car. <laughs> Look at me! I'm not talking to you, are you? <laughs> right, here we go. So you've got everything set up, yeah? Yeah, and you're good to go. Third gear, roll on. We'll be in third as well from 50. But you know, you just get level with this car because I'm calling it in. Okay, let's let's go. Right, go, go, go. All right, all right, darling. Here we go. Come on, get level. What level. gear am I in? What gear am I in? Third. You're in third? Yeah. Okay, here we go, Sam. You ready? Three, two, one, go. Come on. Oh, 
this is quicker. It's actually got less horsepower. It's got 800, that's got 850. Really? Yeah. The gearing's better in this. So his third's probably like your fourth or something. In fact, do you know what? Go at um, 50 miles an hour and tell me how many revs you're pulling in third. 3,300-ish. And I'm 3.1. That's the same oh, then. Yeah, it's the same. Okay, so that doesn't help you out, mate. But your car's still fixed, yeah? Yeah, I can confirm I have still fixed to this car, yes. Now we're going to do a brake test from 100 miles an hour. See which car stops in the shortest distance. Whichever car does, wins. Well, he wins the brake test. If you'd rather watch another drag race with a Dodge Challenger Demon, click on the pop-out banner up there, follow the link in the description below. If not, see what happens in this brake test. Right, I'm going to brace myself because I've got no steering wheel to hold on to. Now I can see how good Here I am comes the line. Testing. Okay, or how prematurely you hit the brakes. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. Wow! I can't even see him. I think we lost that quite comprehensively, Sam. <laughs> oh, I won. I won. Do you know what I was hoping for then? Some actual like racing driver insight as to why he won so much. All we got was a giggle and self-congratulation. Anyway, <laughs> thanks to all the guys that lent us these cars. Thanks to Yanni, thanks to Sam, thanks to me. Anyway, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. Let me know which is your favourite car out of the three that were in this video in the comments below. Also, let me know if it's right to say that I broke the car when I was just driving it. Anyhow, if you want to watch some other videos, you click on those windows there. And if you click on that box there, you can get a car wow to sell your car. Do you know what you do? Click the box. No, you, you click the box and then you just upload some photos, give a brief description about your car, then dealers all across the country will bid on your car. You just pick the highest offer, they'll come to your house, set the car away, put the money into your account. One word, genius. Genius. Anyway, so check that out. Thanks for watching.